Hey guys, welcome back to NextGen Block. Uh, and in this video, I want to show you how you can apply a crisscross transition between two videos in VHDC Video Editor Pro version. Now, it's actually super easy to apply a crisscross transition between two videos in VHDC Pro. So, without further delay, let's get started and see how you can do this. Now to demonstrate this, I've already imported two demo videos in the editor. So this is my first demo video and this is my second demo video. And as you can see right here, I've not overlapped my videos which I normally do when I make a transition tutorial. Rather, I've placed them one after the other in the timeline like this. Now to apply a crisscross transition between these two videos, what you need to do first is you need to add a rectangle object on top of the screen. So to do that, go to add object, select rectangle and now click on OK. Now mark your rectangle object on top of the screen like this and then click on this option which is set the same size as the parent has. Now currently the duration of my rectangle object is 23 seconds 466 milliseconds. So I would like to reduce the duration of my rectangle object to just 2 seconds. So inside the duration option, you need to write 02.000 and then press enter on the keyboard. Next, what you need to do is you need to place your rectangle object right in the middle of both your videos. So my first video ends at 14 seconds, 200 milliseconds. So one second before 14 seconds 200 milliseconds will be 13 seconds 200 milliseconds. So click on your rectangle object and inside the time option you need to write 13 seconds 200 milliseconds and then press enter on the keyboard. Now what this has done is first half of my rectangle is on the left side covering my first video and second half of my rectangle is on the right side covering my second video. Alright, now double click on your rectangle object and now what you need to do is you need to go to video effects, go to transitions, select shattered glass and now click on OK. Now place your shattered glass effect right at the beginning like this and click on your shattered glass effect, press Ctrl C to copy it and then press Ctrl V to paste a duplicate. Now place the second shattered glass effect right after the first shattered glass effect like this. And now what you need to do is you need to click on your first shattered glass effect and look inside the adjustment settings which is present inside the properties window. Inside the adjustment settings you will find this option called presets where currently custom is selected. So click on this drop down list and scroll down below. and Inside this list, you need to select this particular option called Fade in Crisscross Rectangles. So the preset number is 69 and the name is Fade in Crisscross Rectangles. So select this option. Perfect. Now click on your second shattered glass effect and once again look inside the adjustment settings which is present inside the properties window. And inside presets, once again custom is selected so click on this drop down list and scroll down below and this time you need to select this particular preset fade out crisscross rectangles so the preset number is 70 and the name is fade out crisscross rectangles so select this particular preset and that's it and so now if I just quickly go back to the main editing timeline and if I play the video for you so watch the crisscross transition which happens when the cursor moves from the first video to the second video. Perfect. Let me just quickly play the video for you once again. So this is how you can apply a crisscross transition between two videos in VHDC Video Editor Pro version. Do let me know your thoughts in the coming section below. Like the video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. I will again see you in the next video. Till then, thanks for watching.